<laughs> so, Mr. Craig Callahan, we'll start off. Talk about the role reversal from almost getting rear naked choked yourself to pull him one off. What is that? Is that how you expected to win that fight? Um, no, nah, not at all. I knew I could sort of finish it anywhere it went. If I did get a top, top position, I reckon I could get a sub. But choke was on for a bit. Obviously, just kept pushing my back to the cage and, and hipping out and just kept releasing pressure off that neck. And eventually got out and, yeah, um, he still had the choke on when he was sort of tripoding on me. And then as he went down, sort of just capitalised on it and seeing his neck pop up as he tried to get out and just cinched it in. That was it. Um, the head kick in the first round as well. Um... That, it looked like it connected and he sort of wobbled and stumbled back. Did you think that was it then? No, nah, I didn't think it was it. He's tough, mate. Like, he's fought a lot of good guys and, you know, he's, he's durable. I know it wobbled him and I did go in and, unfortunately, I, uh, I threw that low, <laughs> the low body kick, um, which just sort of grazed the, grazed the wrong part, which, uh, yeah, unfortunately, I couldn't capitalise. But, mate, that, uh, that head kick, um, we drilled that the whole camp. So, Craig, obviously after you won the belt, you know, the emotions kind of came pouring out of you and, you know, you laid the belt down in front of your coaches. How important is it having a team around you that you're not just learning technique from, but you have people around you that support you and have your back truly as, you know, you progress through martial arts, which is such a journey of up and downs? Mate, you can't even put a price on a team like that because, you know, you have days... You know, days and fights where, especially like days of training, a terrible night of training and, and, you know, Adrian will see if you're struggling or if you look down, he'll come and check on you. You know, I've, I've had an up and down career and, you know, I've lost a few in a row and I've won a few in a row and, you know, you do, if you lose a couple in a row, you do sort of lose a bit of that self-belief, but, you know, that the team's never stopped believing in me and then they're just finally now getting me to believe in myself the way that they believe in me and, uh, yeah, it's sort of showing. So, Craig, you look excellent out there, providing you have no major injuries. When are you looking to get back in there? Um, oh, sometimes next year I, like I said in the cage I've um, got my first born son um, Jew well first son Jew sorry not born yet uh, end of November so roll into Christmas I'll be pretty busy the, the start of next year yeah yeah um, so mate I've just got to see how that goes and, and then just try to line one up after that just before you go mate just before you go what celebrations look like tonight um, I'll have a couple beers uh, with some workmates uh, that come along and some friends that flew down from Townsville. Other than that, I'm getting Maccas on the way home. I'm going to sleep. Good stuff, mate. <laughs> Enjoy. Thanks, Thanks brother. Thank you.